guys, so I'm here today with another review for you, and this one's going to be sponsored by BlackHairSpray.com. Um, this is my first time working with this company, so, you know, I'm excited. Um, I get excited anytime another company contacts me about doing reviews for them or anything like that. So, let's go ahead and get into this review. So, this one is going to be another blue unit. I know y'all have just recently probably saw the last blue unit I just posted about, which is, I will leave a link up there. This is from Vela Vela. Um, this is a synthetic unit, as usual, you know, when I'm doing my Beauty on the Budget series, all of those wigs are synthetic. So this one is going to be synthetic wig, and it's called Bess. Um, and I will go ahead and leave, like, a screen capture of what it looks like on the website instead of, like, using the stock card because I don't have the stock card right now. I just have the bag. So <laughs> I got to improvise. But I think y'all would like that better because you can actually get a view of what it looks like on the site and what it looks like on the models um, and the color selection and all that stuff too. So I will go ahead and insert that over here somewhere so you can see that. That's why I will stand more off center from the camera. Um, so I'll be able to insert little clips and whatnot into it. So this hair was sent to me courtesy of blackhairspray.com. This unit retails for $22.95 on their website right now. Um, let's see. So this unit comes with two combs in the front, a comb in the back, and adjustable straps. It is definitely big head friendly. I have had no issues with this hair at all. This hair is definitely like my funky for my funky fresh divas. It ain't, you know, this color at least. Like you can get the hair in like a 1B or a 2 or something and be safe. But I love this color. Like y'all know how I feel about blue hair. Blue hair and me just go together. Just yeah. like a finer texture of hair. You get kind of, you get some of that human-like feel with this hair, but you still know it's synthetic. It has a deep part side right here. It did not come with any lace on it at all, so you're not getting a lace front. You're getting just a little side part right here that goes kind of deeper back. Um, I do get a little bubble right there where it's a little, a little loose. D blue. Um, and it is a really, really nice blue color, y'all. Like, it is a gorgeous blue color. I feel like this is a this is like a good black girl blue. Like if you're like around my complexion, I feel like this is a good blue for you if you want to step out the box and just kind of you know experiment a little. This is a good blue for you. Um, so like I said, I really don't have any issues with this hair. Um, I've worn this hair a couple of times, so I've worn this hair a couple of times so far, um, and I haven't really dealt with any shedding. I haven't really dealt with any tangling. Mainly because, you know, I'm not really doing, when you have curly hair like this, you don't want to overly manipulate it unless you're trying to go for like a fro. I'm not really trying to go for a fro with this hair. Um, I feel like, you know, it just looks nice as is. So I kind of tend to, I tend to just leave the hair as is when it looks like this. Because I just like it like this. I really do. I just really like it like this. Um, so, y'all, I really don't have any real cons about this hair. It's big head friendly has two combs you know i don't really care about the part situation because with hair like this people know yeah like seriously i don't really care people know it's a wig i mean everybody knows i wear wigs i just changed my snapchat i just changed wigs on snapchat like four times within like the <laughs> within the last 30 minutes so people know that i wear wigs it's no secret um i ain't, ain't no shame in my game but if you want to make this part look a little bit lower if you want the part to look a bit, little bit more, if you want the part to look a little bit more natural, you can always do the concealer trick, just add some up there, or you can pull some hair out of the parting area to try to make you a little, something a little bit wider, because it is like basically, there's really basically not much there to work with. So let me get a close up of this for you. Okay. But yeah, so. I like this hair. I don't see any problems with it. Um, I don't really see people having problems with it. Um, and it and on the um, website it is like a middle part, but I felt like the middle part kind of looked weird on me. I like side parts. That's that's I think it's a big head thing, maybe because in my family everybody thinks they have big foreheads, so everybody's always side part, side part, side part. So <laughs> I, you get used to wearing the side part. So yeah, guys. So anyway, thanks again to blackhairspray.com for sending me this unit. And thanks again to all of you for watching my videos. Virtual hug, guys. Yes. 
See, I'm like in a good mood today. Like, this is a good day to film. This is a really good day. So anyway, guys, that is all for now. Um, so anyway, guys, I really, like I said, I don't have any cons. I don't have any real cons about this hair. I've had no issues with it. Um, I haven't really manipulated it to have issues with it either. So, you know, sometimes you gotta baby this hair if you want it to like last you a couple of months at the most. Um, but for me, I can keep wigs for years because I go through so many and I have just so many to just keep wearing and stuff. So I'm never really wearing the same one all the time and just constantly like wearing it out. So y'all probably will see me next year with this same hair. If I have like some Zeta event where I just want to wear some blue hair, you may see me in this one. But yeah, guys. So anyway, let me go ahead and show y'all what the back of this hair looks like. And then side view. And then the front again. Um, so yeah guys, thanks again to blackhairspray.com um, for sending me this hair. And thanks again to watching. And thanks again to all of you for watching my review. Like I said, I really don't have nothing negative to say about this one. I Y'all can see it on my face that I like this hair. I, there ain't no hiding it. There ain't no denying it. Nothing. Um, I just like this one. I really do like it. So anyway guys, that is all for now. And I'll talk to you soon.